Today, I'm gonna to show you how to put a light on top of a post. What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda out here with my mailbox. And my mailbox post here is a four x four and it's topped with this little beautiful globe. But I don't want the globe, I want a light. So I'm gonna show you how to put this light on top of this post. This is by Twins Lux. And the reason it might be called Twins Lux is because that you get two of these lights. And I only need the one. But like I said, if you have fence posts or something like that, a deck that wraps around, you want to add some light, it could be a cool way to do this. I picked these just because they seem to kind of match the style of the other things I have in my house. And they have a square shape, kind of this, ooh, kind of this crackle glass bulb inside. And then I assume the LED light is right up at the top. You can kind of barely see it right in there. So you get the LED emitter. Uh, all black plastic. It also comes, I think, in a bronzish color. You can see here it's slightly textured. We have a little grate around the glass itself. And then up here on the top, we have the little roof with the little solar panel here. So you get a little crystalline solar cell and that should charge up the light. I think it only takes a few hours to charge up the battery and that will power the light for five or six hours. So it's a pretty good return. And right in here, you can see there's a little switch and that is your power switch. So off and on, you'll be able to switch that. And now if I cover up the light sensor, you can see that it lights up and gives a nice warm light look cool now what you can see on the bottom here is that this opening should fit on a post that i think is three by six by three by six so it's a little under four inches and what you can see here is it'll slip right on the top and then we have a hole here and a hole here and you use these screws to attach it now if you have a large post like a five incher you take this you put this on top and now this will sit on a five inch post. But what if you have a four inch post like me? Well, you use this other piece here and you slide this in and now this opening is four inches. So, and I'll need this whole base, but what I can do now is put the screws in here to hold it down. And then I will put the screws in on the side here to attach it to the top of my mailbox. So let's try it out. I've gone ahead and attached the light to the base there and there are holes already drilled. So when installing this, what I realized is that this screw is not long enough to go through this outer frame and then the inner frame and then to the post. So what you actually have to do is you have to take this inner frame and attach it first. So now I've got this base attachment attached to my post. And the funny thing is that I think it fits tighter and more snugly when this is mounted upside down like that. So now all I have to do is drop the light on it. Installed, looks pretty good. You can see here that the painted aluminum or whatever is slightly shinier than the matte finish of the light, but that's what it looks like. Now we gotta see what it looks like in the dark. It's getting dark, it's not completely dark, but I love it. It puts out a decent amount of light here and it does a couple things. One, it just dresses things up. That's pretty nice. But then two, it's also a little bit of safety because my black mailbox, you might run into it if you're hugging the curb or something. So it's kind of nice to have that light. You know that there's something there. And when it gets dark and you're checking your mail or something, you know where it is. And it's kind of a little bit of a guide when you're going out and trying to find your mailbox in the middle of the night. So you can do it on fence posts. You can put it on your deck edge. I think it's a really classy little subtle light and they're really easy to install and they are quite cheap so if you want to pick this one up i'll put a link to it in the description below peter von panda out